what's going on you guys? It's your man Stefan once again and welcome to Udon Nepdon. God, I hope I'm saying that shit right. Anyways, you um as you go as you go. I was looking on Game Joe for some games to play, but I had this on my laptop for about a week. Um uh, Yeah, it was a week. It was a week. But um I decided to give it a go. Um, only reason why I didn't play it sooner is because I hate scary games, as you guys know. Um, and this seemed like it was a scary game. I don't like not not necessarily like blah 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 scary, but you know, um, I don't know. It just seemed like it had a very very creepy atmosphere, you know, gameplay style and all that. So I tried to, to avoid it, but apparently this game is very short. Um, what you do is you play as some wizard. <laughs> um, you know, I don't know. He's a he's a he's the holder of the carrier, whatever of some shit of like some artifact or some shit, and he has to he or she I don't know. Um, they have to venture into this like dungeon or something and get to the whatever the who's I don't know I'm so unprofessional you pretty much just have to make your way to wherever the fuck and that's pretty much it man um, I thought it was control and a to hold the mirror up I was reading the um, information on the website and it said control a to hold the mirror up but I guess it's just control but I hope you guys enjoyed this video um if you want to play it for yourself, link is in the description. I'm not going to say I recommend it yet because I don't know what the game is about. I don't know what it's going to do. But I'm really hoping that it's interesting and it really... I at least hope the shit scares me. You know, I got to turn this up. But I hope it scares me or something. Or I hope it, you know, is very interesting. I, I don't know about it, but fuck that. Let's just get into the game. Oh, man. Oh, shit. These are some interesting controls, man. When I played, not played, what the fuck, this is my first time. When I, um, when I saw the screenshots of the game, I didn't think that it was a, uh, what kind of, would you call this, like, the old Resident Evil style camera angles? Um, yeah, you can pretty much say that. But, I didn't think it was gonna be like this. I thought it was like some kind of, a uh, whoa, this is most death, the old Resident Evil camera style. But, no, I, um, I thought it was going to be like a uh, first person because I saw this screenshot right here. It was a screenshot of this guy facing that way, but I thought it was going to be like some kind of holy shit is dark down there. But I'm going to go anyways because why not shit. But yeah, I thought it was first person when I... Um, so What the fuck is that? Go, 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 you son of a bitch. Go, go, go. I don't want your company. I really don't want your company. Oh my god, that son of a bitch is gonna get me and he's gonna eat my gonads. Where are you going? No, don't go back. Is he still following me? I don't even know where I gotta go. You know, I'm curious. There's no action button, it's just you in the mirror. So what the fuck does that door have to do with anything? And also, what does the mirror do? Oh my god, he's in here. That is awesome. What is that? That is awesome. So the mirror is a weapon. Well, you use the power of light. You use the power of light to, I don't know what that eye does. I'm pretty sure that opens something, but that was awesome. I like that. It's pretty um, atmospheric. 
atmospheric um, in a sense of not not necessarily being scary but it is like um, it can be creepy honestly I don't even think the developer put that much time into this game I think it was done in a very very short amount of time but it looks very well done like for this style of game it's like an old-fashioned like Resident Evil type game back in the 1990s you know but it was real real interesting man I like the, the design of it and I hope this damn monsters unless that was him I hope that was him nope bro wait a minute nope there's a wall right there What do I have to do here? Yeah? I hope I don't. I'm, I hope I'm not stupid. Oh fuck you! Can you follow me? Follow me, fool. Follow me. Follow me. Yeah, follow me. Come on. Maybe I have to just lure him in, like to the dungeon. Follow me. I'm gonna wait right here. Yeah. Come on. Come on. Come on. Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Come on, you son of a bitch. Come on, you ugly ass, oh you. Come on. There you go. Now I want you to just sit right there. I want you to just sit right there and take this light in your f wait, wait, wait. Die! No! You wouldn't die, man. Shit. Okay, so I got an idea of what to do. You just gotta. I'm guessing you just gotta lure him. And it, it can go two ways. You can either lure him in and run around him, though he's not, you're not really that fast. And you know, um, actually, now that I think about it, when I was reading the comments on the game, somebody somewhat, they, they, um, what was that? Anyways, someone was uh, criticizing the game um, on the speed. And I don't, don't want to really say, well, it's criticism to get the game better, but it's complete though. But someone was um, criticizing the game based on the character's speed, like how he moves so slow compared to the monsters and shit. And it's like I can see where they were. Oh, you can see his eye. But I can see where they were coming from with that because he is very slow. Oh, why, why did he want to die fast? Like I was saying, I can understand them complaining, not necessarily complaining, but noting, um, pointing out the fact that the character is just too damn slow. Like, I at least, I at least wish he would have been, you know, somewhat faster. Or at least there could have been like a, a, you know, like a, um, a temporary speed boost, like sh hold shift down for like three seconds and you'll get a speed boost. Or you could run faster for like three seconds, five seconds or whatever, and then you get a cool down bar that pops up. I mean, there's really nothing to say about the game. I mean, actually there's a lot to say about any game, but, um, what I what I would prefer, and though I don't know like how long the game is for it to work like that, but where is he? Okay, they they should have had like um I don't know like a save mechanic, but then again I don't know how long the game is to even consider a save mechanic, and I don't know like how that would even work because I'm still like fresh into this shit. Got 
got him. No, but anyways, um, it's a very interesting game. The uh, it, and you know, I have honestly, I have to agree with the uh, whoever made that comment um, on the character speed. I have to agree with that because uh, in games like this. You should at least have some kind of temporary speed boost, and maybe the game does have a temporary speed boost, but I doubt it because I would have I would have saw that. But uh, games like this, you you should have a temporary speed boost, especially if you have to go like back and forth in certain areas, or you have to like it like venture into like big ass areas like this, especially when you have to run away from monsters that are basically the same speed as you. Like I don't know, you should you should have some kind of speed boost. Um, you know, something. I swear, if I have to go back just to kill another monster who's chasing me, I'm gonna have a fit. I'm gonna get upset. Crap, man! Oh, there's light over there. I think. Dude, dude, dude. <clears throat> Don't you kill me! No! Oh, you son of a bitch! No, you know what? Screw that. This was Umnam Dubov. Um, developer, forgive me for mispronouncing your name. Uh, game's name. I enjoyed it though. I enjoyed it, but I just can't. I can't deal with that kind of mechanic, man. It's like, listen developer and anyone who watches this game I'm not the type to criticize a game deeply like I'm not the type to, to, to dissect the game for what it is and criticize it and give you tips on what to do and what not to do because I don't even know how to make games I'm just a photo developer and video editor and stuff like that but when it comes to this this will be my first dissection of a game and I'm just gonna do the basics man but First of all, the speed of the character needs to be improved. Well, should be improved or could be something that could be improved. I know the game is complete and I doubt the developer would go back and update that, but that should be like, they should at least be faster because the like the way that monster, the, the last monster that just killed me was running up on me like that. There's no fucking way like there's that based on that little s s part right there just goes to show that I would have had to run back to the first light just to kill him and that would have been very tedious on my time that would have been that would have taken up so much time um because there's I mean I'm pretty sure there's a way to uh yeah, of course it's possible to go into the second light and kill him from there but it's like dealing with the aiming mechanic and having to deal with the speed of your character and the speed of the monster and you know the monster running up on you it is it's difficult to master those when you're playing this game checkpoints there should be some kind of save mechanic man because who the hell wants to sit there and go through all of this and then die one hit kill you should at least have a health bar or something man like a small health bar you know or some hearts or something take it back to zelda for god's sake man where are the rupees and shit but no I mean I like the game it's just there's so much that could be added into it or could have been added into it when the game was in development um, will the developer go back and update it or something or add a little something in there you know a little tweak here or two you know, I don't know I doubt it but that would have made the game a bit better you know? I mean the style of the art style don't fuck with that because I like it I love it do not tamper with that because I enjoy the way it, it's put out to be but there's one more thing in my cranium right now. I know there's one more thing up there that I can um, talk about. Um, I like the ability to uh, kill monsters with that light. Um, the aiming is a bit, you know, like wonky. Uh, you know, it's like the sensitivity of it. You got to deal with that linear, like sun, like light beam. But it's it's cool though. I like it. Um, it's different compared to just like amnesia style where you just you don't have a weapon or anything or like resident evil because this reminds me of resident evil like in that way you have a gun or some or a knife you know you have light in this game and that's cool but um i mean other than that man you know 
speed of character, checkpoints, or save mechanic, health bar, something. It's just a big ass game, like not not necessarily a big game, but a big area that you have to cover, and it's you know it's just uh, I don't know. I like it though. I give it a I give it a seven out of ten for now. Like um, that's not even for now. I just give it a solid seven out of ten. Um, but that's just me though. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video, developer. I hope you watch this video and enjoy it. I really like your game. Um, I would love to play it again. Uh, for those of you who watch it, even the developer, if you want to see me play this game again, let me know. I'm willing to go through it again. Or if you have any other games that you recommend me to play, leave them in the comment section. I most def will get to them eventually. Um, that's pretty much it, man. It's your man, Stefan, signing off, and I'll catch you guys in the next video.